Kim Possible Video Games are a series of action platformer games based on Disney's animated television series Kim Possible. They were mostly released for the Game Boy Advance GBA and Nintendo DS. The game Disney's Kim Possible, What's the Switch? was released for the PlayStation 2. Disney's Kim Possible, Revenge of Monkey Fist, the first game in the series, was developed by Digital Eclipse Software and published by Disney Interactive Studios. Every game afterward was released by the same publisher, but developed by Artificial Mind and Movement. Topic: <laughs> Game Boy Advance. Disney's Kim Possible: Revenge of Monkey Fist, titled Disney's Kim Possible in Europe, was released for the GBA on November 13, 2002, in North America, and November 21, 2003, in Europe. Dr. Draken and Monkey Fist have kidnapped Ron, forcing Kim to locate Dr. Draken's secret headquarters and rescue Ron. The game places the player in the role of Kim. The Bebis and Gil are also enemies in the game. Disney's Kim Possible 2, Draken's Demise titled Disney's Kim Possible in Japan was released for the GBA on September 15, 2004 in North America, July 21, 2005 in Japan, and March 10, 2006 in Europe. The game was developed by Artificial Mind and Movement and published by Disney Interactive Studios. The game places the player in the role of Kim to defeat Dr. Draken, Shigo, Duff Killigan, Falsetto Jones, and Gemini. Draken's demise is divided into four episodes, most of which are sequels to episodes in the show's second season. The first episode, True or Falsetto, Falsetto Jones breaks out of prison and stages a theft to get revenge on Kim Possible for foiling his previous crime in Rufus and Show. In Altitude Attitude, Duff Killigan steals a weather machine and hides it in the mountains. Fortunately, he forgot to steal the instructions, too. This is similar to the TV episode Job Unfair, but also has the Killer Snowman from Day of the Snowman. In The Rufus Factor, Ron asks Kim to help him find Rufus, who has been kidnapped by Gemini. This is a reference to the Rufus Factor epilogue in The Ron Factor. In the last episode, Day of the Destructo Bots, Draken finishes his Destructo Bots from Car Trouble and sends them on a rampage through Middleton. Kim has to stop them before her date with Josh Mankey. Naturally, Draken doesn't make it easy, and neither does Shigo, whom Kim must fight as well. Disney's Kim Possible 3, Team Possible was released for the GBA on August 21, 2005 exclusively in North America. Kim and Ron have teamed up to form Team Possible to defeat Dr. Draken, Shigo, and other supervillains. The game places the player in the role of Kim or Ron. Kim Possible 3 is the first game where Ron Stoppable is a playable character. Throughout the game, both characters must work together to advance through the game, as Kim may not be able to reach an area that Ron can. The game can be played with two players over a link cable connection, if this is not available, the player can toggle each character. The other character has no AI and will not move when the player is not controlling him or her. <laughs> PlayStation 2 Disney's Kim Possible, What's the Switch?, was released in North America on October 19, 2006, in Europe on November 17, 2006, and in Australia on February 15, 2007. It is the first Kim Possible game to appear on a home console, as all the other Kim Possible games were designed for handheld systems. The subtitle is a pun on one of Kim's catchphrases. It is also the first to feature voice acting, all the actors voice their characters. In December 2006, the game was featured as a demo on the official PlayStation Magazine's Demo Disc Issue 111. Both Kim and Shigo are playable characters. In each level, control is relayed between the two of them as they chase Dementor and Monkey Fist around the world. Rufus is also playable at certain points in the game, but only when playing with Kim. Teen heroine Kim Possible and sidekick Ron Stoppable arrive at Monkey Fist's castle to stop Dr. Draken and Shigo from stealing the mystical monkey idol. However, when the two teams fight over the idol, Ron and Draken get their minds switched with each other's bodies. Before Kim or Shigo can do anything, Professor Dementor appears and steals the idol himself. Realizing that she needs the idol to switch Ron and Draken back to normal, Kim takes off in pursuit, unaware that Shigo is also on the trail. 
As a result, the two girls' paths cross continuously, ultimately forcing the two rivals to team up and stop Dementor, who has partnered with Monkey Fist in an all-new scheme. Topic: <laughs> Nintendo DS. Disney's Kim Possible, Communicator was released for the Nintendo DS on November 9, 2005 in North America and March 10, 2006 in Europe. After Dr. Draken kidnaps Wade, Kim needs the player's help to rescue Wade and stop Draken's plan to build yet another doomsday device. The game places the player in the role of Wade's replacement. Disney's Kim Possible, Global Gemini was released for the Nintendo DS in Europe on February 9, 2007, in North America on February 13, 2007, and in Australia on February 15, 2007. It is the last Kim Possible video game. Both Kim and Ron are playable characters. Whereas Kim is more capable of physical movement and direct combat, Ron is more gadget-oriented. Kim Possible and her faithful sidekick Ron Stoppable have been summoned by the World Protection Group Global Justice to rescue their leader, Dr. Director, who is currently being held hostage by her archenemy and twin brother, Sheldon, alias Gemini. Team Possible sets off to stop Gemini's evil secret organization, the Worldwide Evil Empire, we, as well as deal with Motor Ed and Adrena Lin, both of whom have been broken out of prison by Gemini to aid in his grand plan. Topic. PC Disney's Kim Possible, Legend of the Monkey's Eye was released for the PC on May 16, 2006. Monkey Fist has discovered the most potent mystic monkey power of all the monkey's eye. With the force of the monkey's eye, Monkey Fist is plotting to create an evil ape empire by transforming every human into a monkey. Players control Kim, in battles against the evil villain, Monkey Fist, including three boss battles. Players must defeat Monkey Fist and save the world. Players kick, punch, and jump their way through six different levels battling monkey ninjas and mecha monkeys in three unique locations to crush Monkey Fist's attempt at world domination. Players power up by picking up teleporter mini-cells, static shields, bueno nacho tacos, and teleporter power cores to gain strength over enemies and secure access to new areas. The goal is to defeat Monkey Fist and steal back the monkey's eye to save mankind. <laughs> Reception <laughs>